Greetings, graduates. Dr. H here. When you entered VCU as freshmen, could you ever have imagined that your graduation would look like this? My heartfelt sympathies go out to you for not being able to celebrate this in person, to share the joyous hugs with your closest of friends with whom you studied and did whatever else we won't tell mom and dad these past few years. My hope is that you're surrounded by your family and loved ones on this occasion. I'm used to hearing lots of raucous cheering as I read off your names, and I miss that. I hope you're doing that in your homes. Your parents are probably going to party like it's 1999. Okay, that just shows their age. But while it is a time of global struggle, at this moment, it is truly a time to honor your outstanding achievements. More than any students who have come before you, you have faced an adversity different from anything that any of us have ever seen or may ever see again, and you have stared it down to overcome it. We in the math department applaud you. We know what it takes to accomplish this under normal circumstances, never mind with a mid-semester switch to online learning in isolation. Amidst health concerns, job changes, relocation, and every other unforeseen pandemic consequence. You have the most powerful of degrees, and I don't mean your sheet of paper. I mean the degree of experience, the one inside you, that now knows what you can attain in the face of hardship. But let's also recognize that it's a degree in the mathematical sciences. At its core, mathematics teaches you to think about very difficult problems over an extended period of time to try, to fail, and to try again, over and over again, until you succeed. And you have all done that. Whether you studied pure or applied mathematics, mathematical modeling or pedagogy, you have learned technical skills that can help to improve the world we live in, bit by bit. Whether you pursue jobs in industry, academia, government, business, or nonprofit, whether you work for a large company, a small school, a private think tank, or even start your own business, you will use your abilities to solve difficult problems that may not even look mathematical at the start. And if the problems are important, they will be difficult. As the great Danish mathematician Pete Hein famously said, problems worthy of attack prove their worth by fighting back. So. Let me implore you to be courageous in your post-VCU life. Follow a path you believe in and seek out challenging problems to work on. Let your mathematical mind chew on them and work hard to make good progress. Class of 2020, our entire faculty congratulates you. We are proud of you and we believe in you. And your teachers will miss you, so don't be strangers. Come back sometime and let us know what you're up to. Be well.